Boston rap legend Jason said the tragic slang of Nipsey Hussle, the Grammy-nominated Los Angeles rapper and community activist, is devastating to young fans. Police have arrested Eric Holder charging him with Sunday's fatal shooting of Hustle, 33, and two other men who survived. Hustle and Holder were acquaintances, police said, who got into a personal dispute at Hustle's clothing store before Holder returned to the store with a gun. Jason, 47, was born in Connecticut and moved to Mattapan at age 11 before graduating from Canton High School. He's a Brandeis University graduate who lived in Dorchester's Uphams Corner for many years. Jason, whose real name is Jason Rosenwald, has four grown children who graduated from or are currently attending college. His latest album, Kill Ya Boss, was released last year. He spoke with Herald columnist Jessica Heslam about the senseless slaying, it's tragic, him in particular, because from what I know about him, he was so much more about giving back to the community. He was very proactive as far as dealing with the youth in his community. He had this meeting set up with the chief of police on curbing gang violence. He had redone some parks out there. Most rappers don't do that. Most rappers set themselves up for the future, they're not involved in the community like that. Anytime a young kid dies like that it's tragic, but he, in particular, because he was trying to be exemplary for not just black youth, but for youth in general. He and girlfriend, Lauren London had a blended family. He was a parent to his kids. He was really focused on his family. He had just done a GQ shoot. A lot of us older rappers, I'm a little older than he is, but you don't usually see guys that young doing role model, expletive. He was being the head of the family and making sure he was present. He had a beautiful family, the life he led wasn't typical but what happened to him was typical. It's common. How does Nipsey's murder impact his young fans? It's devastating to see somebody that you look up to who's doing so much positive, expletive. He's not an absentee father. He's got a blended family. He's got a famous beautiful fiancé. He's present. He's helping the community. From what I understand, he did everything right and he still got shot in the head over basically nothing. You're ripping role models and people that these kids hold dear, that they idolize, from them. It numbs them. They're already being numbed by social media, television, violent video games and so forth and this just numbs them a little bit more. Traditional ways of growing up are lost.